Today we're making Big Macs, and Big Mac sauce, we're making them three different ways. So here we go. Okay, for your sauce, you're going to need one teaspoon of sugar. I'm using sugar substitute. Okay, we're going to need a half a cup of mayo. I'm getting it out. I'll be with you in a second. Should have measured it before I turned the camera on, but I didn't. Okay, half a cup of mayo. One teaspoon of, of vinegar. Okay, now we're going to need some sweet pickles. We're going to need four tablespoons. And we're going to need two tablespoons of French-style dressing. Two tablespoons. Save this bottle because I can make my own. Put back in it. Okay, then you'll need one eighth of a teaspoon of uh, salt. Okay, I'll need to get uh, one tablespoon of onions. Hold on a second. Okay, here's our minced onions. One tablespoon. Well, it took me so long I had to chop them up. Okay, that's your sauce. Now put this in the refrigerator in a covered dish for one hour before serving. Let it get cold. But this is your Big Mac sauce. And that, that you have it. Are your Big Mac sauce. You'll need one half cup of mayo. Two tablespoons of French dressing, four tablespoons of sweet pickle relish, one tablespoon of minced white onions, one teaspoon of white vinegar, 
one teaspoon of sugar, one eighth teaspoon of salt, and that's it. And we'll be back with you when it's time to make the hamburgers. Three different ways. Okay, we're frying our hamburger. We got onion powder in there. We got pepper. Garlic powder. Salt. This ain't gonna be your normal way of frying your hamburger. Because we're making it three different ways anyway. If you want regular patties, just make you some patties up. Make you a uh, sauce up. Add you some cheese, pickles, mayo, lettuce. And it'd be the same thing. As McDonald's, Big Macs, and it tastes, the sauce tastes just like McDonald's. We make this all the time at our house. Sometimes we make patties and sometimes we don't. Everybody wants something different today, so that's the way we're going to make it, three different ways. And we're even going to add bacon tars. That's something you don't use on a Big Mac. Go back back with you in a second. Okay, we got our bacon. Getting ready to cook it. We're using the same skillet. that we wiped it out. As we put the hamburger in there, we wiped it out. Less mess. Clean up. More, less dishes. Around here, it breaks my, backs, breaks my back to do dishes. The zinc is too low. My husband is too low for him, too low for my son. I don't know who they made that zinc for, but they sure didn't make it for us. Okay, I'll come back with you as soon as that gets done. I gotta wash my hands and I'll be right back. Got a splash of cheese up today. This is what we're using. We got our cheese sliced, we got our onion out, and we're fixing to put these sandwiches together. The what? Three different ways. We have not got no buns today. We got ham, light bread, so that's how we're going to do one of them. That's for my husband. My son wants his on a tortilla. And I'm going to eat mine just on lettuce. Heat your tortilla up in the microwave for 15 seconds. Then add your lettuce. Hamburger. Your sauce. Uh, 
Okay, we're gonna get some cheese. We ain't gonna put pickles on it because it's already got pickles in it. Sorry about that, so nice cowling. Onion. Okay, some bacon. Okay, that's one. Okay, here's mine. Lettuce, salt, some bacon, Hot, 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 hot. Okay. Some sauce. Hamburger. Cheese. Onion. That's homegrown lettuce from the garden. This is uh, grass fed and grass finished beef. These are mine. Okay. Give me a minute. I'll make my husband's. Here's my husband's. Okay, here's his cheese.
I'm gonna give him all kinds of hamburgers. He need it besides that. Because once he gets his bun on there, it won't matter anyway. Top of it. Mess out. Okay. Now, on his bread, we're going to have Big Mac sauce. We're going to let him have a fork to eat his and with. Because he can eat the rest of it later. But there's his Big Mac. There's his Big Mac. Don't they look good? Even though they're not made with buns, they're still going to be good. Okay, let me put all this stuff up and I'll be back with you. If you like this video, push the like, subscribe button at Tanya's Home Cooking on YouTube. Thanks for watching. And you can also find me on Facebook. This is our version of Big Mac at McDonald's and the sauce. Thank you for watching. Bye. This bread for two sandwiches is 23 carbs. For two pieces of bread. And... Four grams of sugar. Thanks for watching. Bye.